Hello friends, I am Abhimanyu Shrivastava and I am going to here to taught you about Siva Ferastonis algorithm, one of the most efficient algorithm to calculate a prime prime numbers below a certain given limit. The most efficient algorithm in uh, in in terms of efficiency and you may say all that and all that. So we will uh, first start by I will explain but start by giving an example from you have to suppose you have to generate a prime numbers below limit 20 so we will go from st natural numbers of 20 so we will start from uh, first prime number 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 2 so we will cross out ev the from the first we will start from 2 and we will cross out every second term which is a multiple of 2 uh, or incoming of 2 and if it is not we will uh, we will not cross out and if it is if it is a multiple of 2 we will cross out so 4 is a multiple 6 is a multiple 8 is a multiple 10 is a multiple 12 is a multiple 14 is a multiple 16 18 and 20 now 3 3 3 uh, every third consecutive term is 9 the uh, every third consecutive which is a multiple of 3 9 and 15 and so on and there is no other for 5 there is no multiple for 7 is no multiple for 11 there is no multiple for 13 is no multiple and 17 19 there is no multiple left so we have prime number like 2 3 5 7 11 13 17 19 okay so now i will tell you about the algorithm you have first firstly you have to take a boolean array boolean array eh? boolean array of n integers set all the prime numbers uh, all the numbers from 2 to n 2 to n to initially true okay now start a loop we will we will use here nested loop okay for start i uh, i will start i from mm, 2 3 till square root not exceeding square root of n now fill, we will start from j which is from i i square plus i square plus i i square plus 2i and not exceeding n we will set all the numbers which is a of j to false for ex example i will explain you 2 i square i square is I see here see here uh, i square is 4 we we have cross out 4 now next time i i will inter will j will increment i square plus i with which is which is 6 now next time it is 8 and so on it will 10 12 14 16 18 18 and 20 and for 3 3 3 3 square 9 and there is no number then it will exceed as uh, it will exceed and for uh, for 3 and uh, 3 plus 3 it will cross out we have already crossed out 12 so and so on so it is the best efficient algorithm to use the prime number uh, to you to generate a prime number below the given limit n okay